What up, YouTube? Uh, long time no see. I know it's been a really long time since my last pickup video and everything. Uh, it's just been busy with finals and everything, but finally got everything all done and moving into winter break and all that good stuff. But yeah, moving on. This is my fifth Jordan review video. As you can see from the box already, it is a Fusion. And I know everyone's probably sick of Fusions, and I know there's a lot of people that don't like Fusions, but I get what I like, and I like these shoes. And so, yeah, so you can see it's a Moon Boot 8, I mean Fusion 8, uh, yeah. So it's a Fusion 8 from, I believe, back in, what was this, May? May? Was it May? Uh, yeah, I think it was either May or June? Was it June? I don't know. I want to say, yeah, it was May. He's going to and... be wearing it in our new video for our rap album oh, called yeah. the yeah. Moon Booty. Moon Booty? Yeah. <laughs> so uh, here you can see it's the Jordan Fusion 8. There's the cool little box that's the black, yellow, white colorway. Or actually, the correct term would be white, black, varsity maze, and yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's, it's maze. I don't know. It's not yellow. It's maze. Maze like corn. Like so corn. these are the yeah. corn Fusion 8s. Yeah, exactly. So, alright, well, moving on into the shoe. Uh, here it is. So here's the uh, Moon Boot, I mean Fusion 8. Uh, yeah. So, um, yeah, I keep saying that, as you can tell, it's pretty Moon Booty, like our <laughs> album, Moon Booty. Yeah. <laughs> so um, uh, it actually looks really nice on feet, though, so that's why I went ahead and got it. And uh, I actually got this colorway because it was the same colorway as my old high school, and I got it to go to match, you know, the, the school for their graduation, and I went to the graduation, and then um, there was... Uh, graduation party afterwards that I got invited to and then the shoe got all messed up but it actually I cleaned it up pretty nice so it still looks good but moving on uh, let's start with the outsole got the white outsole you can tell I've already worn it and everything with the hits of the black on there uh, moving up to the midsole it's that it's leather but it's not like a patent leather it's kind of like a shiny just like shiny leather it's not like a patent leather or a regular leather uh, it's got a nice like gloss it's like a glossy leather then you got that uh, yellow contrast stitching going throughout. Then uh, moving on to the upper of the shoe, uh, full leather upper. You got the tumbled leather around the straps and everything going all the way around the toe box, back up the straps. And then you have the perforated leather throughout the rest of the shoe. Uh, on the back heel, you got this uh, black suede. Uh, it it's pretty nice. Uh, it would have been a lot nicer before I wore the shoe, but after wearing it, you know, and, and it was, you know, it's Portland, it gets rainy. So uh, here on this back tab, it's also suede, and it's actually a lot nicer than the rest of the suede on the rest of the back of the heel. Uh, you got the white Nike, white Nike with the swoosh with the yellow air. Then it's actually like a, a strap, so, you know, when you pull these back, you can pull them back and then strap it all together. You got the Velcro and everything right there. Then you got the black Air Jordan strap on each side that you see on all the Jordan 8s. Uh, then, uh, let's see, moving on to the rest of the shoe, uh, you got that same black suede going all through the eyelets. The suede from, the, the, back from up. the heel or from the, from the uh, uh, tag? The, the suede tab. from the tag, actually. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's really nice. So the suede is a lot nicer on the eyelets and the tag than it is on the rest of the heel. And that goes all the way through here and yeah. Then uh, you got that uh, little uh, hit of that little kind of camouflage kind of look you see on all the Jordan 8s. This time it's in the yellow, black, gray, and white. And you have that on both sides. Really nice detail, I thought. I really liked that. Uh, then you have the little straps that go around the shoe. You know, classic to the Jordan 8. You know, with the little hits of the yellow on the little clips. That black 23 with the white. You know, black outline with a white 23, really nice. Then you got the Jordan Air Force One lace lock right there at the bottom. And then on the tongue, it's that, you know, really it's really cushiony, actually. Really, really squishy. A lot more squishy than you would see on regular 8s. And, uh, it's you know, it's just that nylon tongue with the little Jordan patch there with the little felt kind of Letterman's jacket material. The yellow, the black, and the gray hits. And then on the inside, of course, you got the uh, the best of both worlds. I've seen on all the fusions, with the it's yellow with that little kind of silver grayish writing. And then the inside liner is black. And then I'll probably show you this one because it still has the Jumpman in there with the yellow Jumpman. The other one wore off Water on the other shoe. Bases a little bit. Oh yeah, so yeah, so it's the black okay, insole yeah. with the black sole and the yellow Jumpman. 
And uh, yeah, uh, retail on these I believe was 140. I was able to pick them up for 120, and uh, I know that's really pricey for fusions for people to pick up fusion. I know a lot of people just usually pick them up on discount or just wait till they go on sale. But I actually really like these. I really wanted these, and they don't look too bad on feet, which I'm going to show you right now. But before I do that, uh, today on feet I had these uh, infrared Air Max 90s, the 2010 release, and yeah. I also had on these White Sox, yes. which you can get at your uh, local White Sox retailer. They have a full cotton full, upper. Full cotton upper. I'm pretty sure any retailer you go to will have a full White Sox uh, size run. So uh, cool. there's you know no need to uh, panic about not getting your size. Yeah. <sighs> Alright, so here's them on feet. I like to rock them with like, you know, little straps out. You know, just kind of like that. Do one straps out, one straps in. Oh, I don't know how to do it. Straps in, like lock, uh, lay, lace them up. Strap it. Uh, strap it up. You know, like that. When you do strap it up, it gets pretty tight. It gets pretty tight around my foot, so <laughs> I don't really like to strap it up. Uh, you know, it's a lot more mm -hmm. comfortable. Just you know, unstrapped and everything. So here's just a look at them on feet. Uh, I thought they looked pretty nice. Um, you know, uh, from just looking at them, they definitely look like a moon boot. But after you get them on feet, they don't really look that bad, and they you know came out pretty well. I thought. Really liked the colorway. Uh, never saw it on any other eights, so it was nice to see you know like a different colorway just on the fusions. And uh, yeah, so that's about that for that. Um, also, uh, you know, shout out to Polly P for hooking me up with this uh, Seeking the Throne beanie for Christmas. So. <sighs> So I'll do a little quick review on this and the Seeking the Throne hoodie I have coming in later. So that's, it's uh, SeekingTheThrone.com for clothes by them and stuff. Really dope website, uh, really dope uh, group of guys, you know, love what they're doing over there down in LA. So uh, check them out. Uh, also, be sure to check out me and Polly P at, um, excuse me, at a High Top Bully tomorrow, December 11th at 330 Rich Street uh, in San 360. Francisco. 360. 360. It's 360? Okay, so it's 360. It was 330, I guess now it's 360. I think they, they changed it. I saw that too. They got it later. Yeah. Yeah, so it's 360 Rich Street. So uh, you can check them out on Twitter, twitter.com slash bully. Uh, same thing with Seeking the Throne. It's twitter.com slash seeking the, and then the throne is, Thrun. is yeah, it's throne without the O. So it's seeking the, and then T-H-R-N-E. Um, you can also check out me and Yo Pauly P on Twitter, twitter.com slash MikeyRocks18 for me. Rock spelled R-O-X, the 1-8. And Polly P is uh, yo uh, twitter.com slash yo Polly P, all one word, all lowercase. And that's also his YouTube, right? It's yo yes. Polly P. Yeah, it's also his YouTube channel. Uh, if you're into Adidas, you want to check out some Adidas stuff, uh, definitely check out his channel. He's got a lot of you know stuff popping off over there. Uh, also, be sure to subscribe to his list on Twitter. There's a bunch of really dope uh, sneaker pages, uh, sneaker Twitters, you know, websites, all that stuff on there that you should follow. I'm on the list, so you know, it's going to be awesome. Uh, so yeah, this is my fifth Jordan video, the Fusion 8s. You know, let me know in the comments what you think about the Fusions. Like them, don't like them. Is there certain numbered Fusions you like or don't like? And, uh, you know, just let me know about that. Uh, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And I guess that's a wrap. Uh, hopefully any of you in the Bay Area see you tomorrow at High Top Bully. So, peace.